Hey, main Halloween ideas for a happy haunted celebration. This is a country living book, and like the photos are seriously 90s. What's this? 1999. So, yeah. So, you got it's Halloween, the jack o' lantern, trick or treat. So, it's more like here's stuff to do haunted home corn husks and branches with autumn leaves and berries or dangling apples celebrate the harvest season and are fetching huh are fetching hung at doorways room entrances and our mantles must spread out with fall colored leaves makes a fitting centerpiece on a serving table how hollowed out cabbages pumpkins and turnips are fun vessels for halloween treats so and you got a little side note here of like different Halloween scary movies one could watch. So you like it gives you like ideas and it talks about like things you could do. And so like creating a haunted house, things that you could do to make that. Party ideas. So, like, thing, kind of like, what you could serve, activities, so, and then, it goes on for like a few pages, but it does get into things you could make, so you got block print invitations, so it kind of gives you like a picture, um, stuff you would need, and then, how to make it, and then you got the cutout invitation, pumpkin cutout invitations, uh, tablecloth. So it does go on a, a few pages of things that you could make, and so if you are the type of person who likes to do these types of things, this would be. Uh, book to pick up. It's not like decoration specific or costume specific. Uh, then it goes into like a chapter about the jack-o'-lantern like pumpkins. So the story of the jack-o'-lantern tool and supplies. So and then it gives like tips and stuff on like carving and like pumpkins in general. So it doesn't gives like it only gives like two ideas really on what you could do with the pumpkin it's more tips in general and then you get into costumes so uh, you got costume ideas you got a few here um, Pirate, a strip, a striped pullover, a red vest, dark pants tucked into boots, and a banana tied around the head are the basics. Add an eye patch made from black paper and tied with elastic. Don't forget a large gold hoop earring in a cu cutlass made of cardboard spray paint silver tied to the waist. Ladybug or other critters, and you got some other suggestions here, but. Uh, stuff you could do for the trick-or-treaters uh, which is candy bowl so like things made the night of for the night of you got like the devil costume from the front so like the crafts you got So, like the front, you got the title, kind of like brief intro, what you need to make it and how to make it, and you got the picture, you got like a red writing hood right there. Some are a page, some might be a little longer, you got a line there. So there's a few things that you could make for your kid. There's also a few recipes as well, pineapple glazed hams. 
spicy three bean chili and a few other things as well and then at the end you got templates so these aren't exact size so it tells you enlarge 400% one square equals one inch so a lot larger than this this would be for the devil costume so it does say to enlarge so you do get an idea of how to make them so if you are that type of person who likes sewing and you got the templates right there but you can also use it for other idea for the other ideas that are in here there is a few items that you could take out and use or adapt on your own but yeah homemade handmade halloween ideas for happy haunted celebration by country living happy readings